It's Trey with Daddy Mojo. I've wanted to try this for a while. We purchased a recently roller coaster. It's a STEM-based toy. Smiling. That's good for ages six and up. We've got uh, two in the key demographic right here with us. We're gonna play with it. Supposedly, it can create up to 40 different contraptions, different layouts from easy to difficult. We'll give it to two kids, six and eight, and see how they do. So when you open up the game, everything's in nice bags like this. And it's important to point out that the game, the activity, is going to need some parental oversight initially. Here's why. Why? <laughs> Thanks for asking. In the box, you've got these little pieces here that build up the pieces that will go here. And you've got the playing cards here. Get green for easy, orange for medium, blue hard, and red for super hard. And you have, you have to read this first. Read the instructions first, and then do that. Obviously, it sounds kind of silly. Read the instructions, but there you are. Cactus. One would think that's why you're watching this video, but could also be for entertainment value and random kid comments. So let's build the first coaster for our young children. Lay him out at the eight-year-old. Said he knows how to do it. Let's see if he does. So right off the bat, I know that this is a little bit too complex for our six-year-old, even though the box indicates it's good for six and up. However, it's a good Lego-esque challenge for kids who are slightly older or for six-year-olds who are really Lego fluent. So once you pick the card and you, you figure out the pieces a little bit, every roller coaster construction that you make is going to start with that one there, the orange one at the beginning and the orange one at the end. And it's clearly labeled on these handy guides, basically the instruction guide. Read this and it'll save you lots of time. It's got the star track and the end track, and in between, that's where the puzzle is for your young STEM learner to figure out what pieces go to make the roller coaster go down. Try that blue one and see if that rocks the joint. Try that. There you go, now you're rocking. Now what pieces go in from the blue? Charles, you shout in a second. Yes, buddy, hang on. Hang on, hang on. Let, let, him, let him put it together. Uh, this? Uh, yeah, yeah. Put that together. Okay. And then send it home. <laughs> let your brother do it, please. Let your brother try. Okay. Now let your brother try. Oh, then I will go two times. Cool. The roller coaster grids and the track, it attaches to the sides of the post. It just slips in there like a glove. Very simple. Once you figure out where it goes, you're rocking and rolling. Let's try something more difficult. You can do it. You did it before. Good. Now squeeze that in. Boop. Where's the roller coaster? Oh. We need it. Oh, wait, oh. Yeah, here's the fault. Good. Now, oh. let him do it first. He built it. He built it. Wait, that's the one that I did. Negative, different one. Ah! <laughs> let me do it. Wee. Let him do it a couple times, buddy. Wee. That was good for him. Woo this will be the awesome. That's good, Charlie. Is that the correct length? Yes. It could be a little shorter, maybe. What's well, one What's one shorter than the blue? Good, good, good.
this game far exceeded expectations. Roller Coaster, it retails for around $25, and that's a little bit high for us on the retail end, but it's really well constructed, and your kids are going to love it. The only caveat I would say is that the box says ages 6 and up, you're going to be okay with it. Maybe ages 8 and up, or if you're a 6-year-old, if your 6-year-old is going to play with it and use it, parents be prepared that you're going to need to help them build structures, because our 6-year-old was a little bit frustrated trying to put the pieces together. However, after seeing his older brother pop a few together, he loved it, and he loved playing with it, but still putting them together was a little challenging for him. Second tip is these. These cards, stick to these, because even our eight-year-old, he wanted to be all free-range and build his own crazy roller coasters. Eh. I said, no, follow the cards and see what happens. He did card one, then card nine, and then a couple others, and they really helped build the, I guess, the, the mind template as to how this toy works. Because it does require a little bit of instruction, even for eight-year-olds. And I'm not, I'm not talking instruction that parents give them. I'm talking kind of experimentation play where the eight-year-old can, can jive on it by themselves. And they get it, and it's a lot of fun, and it's a hoot. Highly recommended. It's a roller coaster, and it gets a big old two thumbs up from uh, Daddy Mojo.